I have been a Republican all of my life, born and raised Virginia girl, conservative family. Um, this will be the first year I will come out and vote for a Democrat. I think he's the best candidate to bring different factions together. I currently own a small business in Fredericksburg. It's an employment agency. Um, I have seen firsthand um, how much our economy has changed. Um, when I lost a friend in Iraq, um, I started getting away from being a Republican. I just didn't feel that they were supporting the military. And I started researching more and more about Barack Obama, and he was a lot more in line with my views as a veteran and just as a mother and an American. Just because President Bush started it does not mean that he needs to continue it. And I can't support someone who stated that we were going to be in Iraq for the next 100 years. And I don't want to be a widow at 23. It's just obvious who's thinking of us. And that's Barack Obama. Uh, John McCain voted for a war and then voted against increasing funding to the VA to care for those veterans four years running. And that there's no logic there for me. I mean, how do you vote for a war then refuse to care for the people that are getting hurt there? We've been canvassing in my neighborhood going door to door. The Republicans are going to stay and do the same old, same old. I do not see any changes coming up in the next four years with John McCain. We've got to change now. Volunteering for this campaign has given me a chance to say, well, at least I'm giving them the opportunity to come home. And if I can get just 100 extra people to vote in my precinct or 200 or even just five, if that means that we win the election and can bring the troops home, those votes just saved lives. Any free time I have, it's theirs. Um, anything I can do, I've done phone banking um, to entering data registering voters um, and I just I love it because I feel even if it's only an hour I'm giving something hopefully getting him elected as president and it's great I love it I'm sorry